I'm sorry I do the Muppet Battle without you, but like, yeah, I, I, I did it. I did it after a lot of tries. Oh, my pet looks like it's time for dessert. I was talking, huh? A telegram from the spiders in the ruins? What? They're saying they saw you, and even if you hurt others, you never get a single spider. Oh my, this has been a big misunderstanding. I thought you were someone that hated spiders. The person who asked for that soul, they must meant a, a different human in a striped shirt. Sorry for all the trouble. <laughs> I'll make it up to you. You can come back here anytime, and for no charge at all. I'll wrap you up and let you play with my pet again. <laughs> Just kidding. I'll spare you now. Muffet is sparing you. So I'm actually going to spare her too. Because I don't want the genocide ending. But I, at the same time, also don't want the pacifist ending. Well, oh, Metaton. It's a poster for Metaton's later stage uh, performance. A tragic tale of two star-crossed lovers kept apart by the tides of fate. Looks like it's almost time for the performance. Gosh, dang it. Oh, it's not dark. Oh, that human. What is it? Yeah, that's Metaton. Could it be? My true, my one true love. This is like Cinderella or something, isn't it? I called it. I'm getting uncomfortable vibes right now. That Metaton looks, oh my love. Please run away. I'm really getting uncomfortable. Monster King forbids you to stay. I'm getting really, really uncomfortable right now. Humans must. It's gonna say die, isn't it? Live far apart. Oh, no, never mind. I wanna. This makes me feel uncomfortable. Even if it breaks my heart. They'll put you. No, now we're getting into my Yandere things, you know? Oh, crap. It'll suck. <laughs> and then you'll die a lot. <laughs> I'm actually starting to like this. Really sad. You're gonna die. Cry, cry, cry. So sad it's happening. I want to see, uh, so sad, so sad that you are going to the dungeon. Well, toodles! <laughs> well, we're back into the heat world, but I guess. Oh no, whatever shall I do? My love has been cast away into the dungeon. A dungeon with puzzles so dastardly, my par paramour will surely perish. Oh heavens! Have mercy, the horrible colored tiled maze. Each cup has their own sadistic function. For example, a green tile sounds a noise and you want to a monster. Wait a second. Didn't we see this puzzle about a hundred rooms ago? That's right. You remember all the rules, don't you? Great. Then I won't waste your time repeating them. Balls! Oh, and you better hurry, because if you don't get through in 30 seconds, holy sh balls will happen. You'll be incinerated by these jets of fire. <laughs> My poor love, I'm so filled with grief, I can't stop laughing. That doesn't make sense. I feel like you don't like me. Good luck, darling. Oh, My love has fallen down. Oh, this! Gosh, dang it! I go that way. What the? Oh, uh, well, that one's. Oh, that's fire or no? Okay. What's going on? Oh, I'm so sorry. 
Arms. Oh, I'm so sorry. Looks like you're out of time. Oh, it's balls. Here comes the flames, my darling. They're closing in. Oh, our balls getting closer. Oh, my. Any minute now. Gonna turn off. Robotic cough. <clears throat> Ring. Watch out. I'll save you. I'm hacking into the firewall right now. Oh no. How could this happen? Foiled again by the brilliant Dr. Halfarms. That's right. Come on, Metaton. Give up already. You'll never be able to defeat us. Not as long as we work together. Your puzzles overgo and... Now, your puzzle's over. Now go home and leave us alone. Puzzle over? Oh, Fice, darling, what are you talking about? Did you forget what the green tiles do? They make a sound when you have to fight a monster. Well, darling, that monster is me! <laughs> Made it on attacks again. Oh my gosh, I'm just gonna miss, right? This is it, darling. Say goodbye. Is that your phone? You better answer it. Hey, hey, this seems bad, but don't worry. There's one last thing I installed on your phone. See that yellow button? Go. Go to this phone, act menu, and press it. There even is a act menu. The phone won't save me now, darling. Oh, sh balls, what the? Oh no! Oh, balls! Well, I'm just gonna put the stand right now. You wouldn't dare use the act command and press that button. What is the act command? Uh. Oh! Press the yellow button. Phone. This is it, darling. Yeah, Say okay. goodbye. Now press C. I can shoot out of my soul, but... Oh, oh, you defeated me. How can this be? You are stronger than I thought, etc. Oh, I'm still using the princess voice. What the heck even is this? Does he even actually want to defeat us? Looks like you beat him. You did a really great job out there. All thanks to you. All thanks to you. Yeah, all thanks to you. Wait, oh no, I mean, you were the one doing everything cool. I just wrote some silly program for your phone. Um, hey. This might sound strange, but c can I tell you something? But before I met you, I, I didn't really, I didn't really like myself very much. For a long time, I felt like a total screw up. I like, like I couldn't do anything without, without ending up letting everyone down. But, but guiding you has made me feel a lot better about myself. So thank you for helping so, thank you for letting me help you. Uh, anyway, we're almost to the core. It's just past MTT Resort. Come on, let's get, let's finish this. Yeah, because I was wondering why nothing was happening with the green tiles. Here he is. I thought for sure I would... If I went to the hotland, I'd sell some nice screams, but nobody wants them. Everybody's just eating star fates and glam burgers, so I'm having a going out of business sale. Would you like to buy some nice cream? Frozen treat warms your heart. Good. You like an ice cream? I'm actually gonna buy a lot of these just because I feel bad. Me. 
maybe four. No, yeah, one more, I guess. I feel kind of bad, but I want to explore. Oh, no, that's. What? What? No! I. Ha! Uh, what the frick? Just. Wait, what? It's uh, Sins. Hey, I heard you were going to the core. How about grabbing some dinner with me first? Yeah. Great. Thanks for treating me. What the f calls? <laughs> Over here. I know a shortcut. Are you just like gonna literally. Oh, uh, having a date with him or something? Well, here we are. So. Your journey's almost over, huh? You must really want to go home. Hey, I know the feeling, but oh, I, though, maybe sometimes, it's better to take what's given to you. Down here, you've already got food, drink, you've already got food, drink, friends. It's what you have to do. Really worth it? Ah, uh, forget it. I'm rooting for you, kid. Let me so let me tell you the, a story. So I'm sent so I'm a sentry in Snowden Forest, right? I sit out there, watch for humans. It's kind of it's kind of boring. Fortunately, deep in the forest, there's a huge locked door, and it's perfect for practicing knock knock jokes. So one day I'm knocking on them. I'm knocking them out like usual. I knock on the door and say, knock, knock, and I suddenly, from the other side, I hear a woman's voice. Who is there? So, naturally, I respond, dishes. Dishes who? Dishes, dishes a very bad joke. Then she just howls with laughter, like it's the best joke she ever heard in a hundred years. So I kept on coming, and she kept, and she keeps laughing. She's the best audience I've ever had. Then, after a dozen of them, she knocks and says, knock, knock. I say, who's there? Old lady, old lady Hugh. I did not know you could yodel. Wow. Needless to say, this woman was extremely good. We kept telling each other jokes for hours. Eventually, I had to leave. Papyrus gets kind of cranky without his bedtime story. But he told, but she told me to come again and so I did then I did again and again and it's a thing now telling bad jokes through the door it rules I like my little leafy impression one day though I noticed she wasn't laughing very much I asked her what what was up then she told me something strange if a human ever comes through this door could you please please promise something watch over them and protect them, will you not? Now I hate making promises, and this woman, I don't even know her name, but someone sin who sincerely likes bad jokes has an intriguity you can't say no to. So is this like Torielli's talking about? Do you get what I'm saying? Uh, that promise I made to her. You know what would happen if she hadn't said anything, buddy. You'd be dead where you stand. Now it's getting kind of scary. Hey, lighten up, bucko. I'm just joking with you. Besides, haven't I done a great job protecting you? I mean, look at yourself. You haven't died a single time. Hey, what's, with, what's that supposed to mean? Am I wrong? Eh. Well, that's all. Take care of yourself, kid. Also, that said, take care of yourself, kid. I kind of realized I kind of said, go kill yourself, kid. But uh, yeah.